my name is Arthur Samoz. I'm a uh, lecturer in fine art here at Tonksis Community College. Photographic image development. This spring semester, I had 17 students who completed the course. They all had the opportunity to show the work that they had made throughout the semester in the, the gallery here at Tonksis. It was a good opening then. A lot of people, a lot of people came through. So to then it becomes a public space. You know, it draws people in that aren't necessarily here for for other stuff. I mean, it's it's a good, it's a great selling point. Bill curates it well too. I like how he brings in artists from the outside. You know, to get some exposure to the gallery. It brings up the level of the gallery when you have these people that are notable, more notable. University term is the capstone class in the photo program. Uh, it's where people get to show off what they've learned over the past couple of years, create a body of work, one body of work for the whole semester of their choosing. The classes run pretty much like a ongoing critique, where we have a series of formal critiques the class participates in, and it's basically taking people, they start with a project proposal, and um, they start creating work based on that, and then it tends to evolve throughout the semester. Tamara King. I felt great about my work being publicly displayed, finally. I felt like a pinnacle moment in my photography career. This class has led me to start my own business. My honeymoon, me and my husband, we took a trip to um, Australia. We got put into a hotel room, which was amazing, but the balcony view was horrendous. It was the view of another apartment building, which was just completely run down. But amongst all of that trash, there was this one apartment building that was just amazing. There was greenery everywhere. Whoever took care of this place really cherished and took care of their apartment. And I just found it amazing that out of something that you could find so dirty and so horrendous, you could find something so beautiful. And that's where my work stemmed from. My name is John Nolan. It's always been my dream to be a photographer, but now I've gained a lot of knowledge by being here. My work being exhibited, not only mine, I think everybody in the class work really shined. When you view the photographs in the gallery, I think they pop. I had to work at it a little bit, but I, I, I think my project really came out well. Photographic image development, we needed a course that I felt that was lacking in my undergraduate development, and that was a course that had you focus on a single body of work that you designed for an entire semester. As an undergraduate here, when you finish the photographic image development course, we show you in the gallery. So you get to have a public display of your work. How does that stand up? How does that hold up? 
I had an entire proposal of what I wanted to do with the gallery. Part of it was student work. The main focus is professional artists, uh, local and from out of state. And then we have community shows. Those are our three main thrusts right now. Every single teacher that I've had in photography has been amazing. They have taught me the importance of lighting, which is, as any photographer knows, is the most important thing in photography. My classmates have all been amazing. They've all been as into it as I have been. And a lot of the classes, we ended up taking all of our classes together. So it was like we were a core group and we made it and survived it together. When you leave here or you leave any school, you're on your own as an artist. So you really need to have some kind of background of how am I going to continue my process. So this is a step in that direction.